So I just tried out a preview of a game called Super Hot. Uh, this game is amazing, guys. I don't know if you've played it, but uh, there's a link down below in the description. It will take you right there. Give this game a shot. It's free to play. I'm super impressed. One of my favorite kind of game genres are games that deal with time displacement. So games like Braid, Max Payne, anytime that you can control time, I'm always just enthralled by that concept. And Superhot does something very similar to what Braid did. Now there's a certain couple of stages in Braid where when you move, time moves forward and backwards. Now Superhot is a first person shooter where when you move, time starts to move forward. This mechanic makes the gunplay in the game amazing. It really feels like you're playing in an action movie of some sort. Something that's really cool about this game is that even though it's a first person shooter, it kind of feels like a puzzle game. Now, now hear me out, this isn't a puzzle game like Tetris. Because you're in control of time, you sort of play this game not in the way that you'd play a generic first person shooter. You have to think about where your bullets are going to be going, and you have to figure out where you're going to move to avoid the incoming fire from enemies. If this was just a regular first person shooter, the game would be super difficult. But adding that time element makes the game just really unique. Now the guys that are making this game are also having a Kickstarter to fund a brand new version of this game that from what I can tell in the videos they've been showing off, looks way better. And if you watch the Kickstarter video for the new game they're trying to create, there's swords, swords, sword time displaced gameplay. Oh God, you can cut bullets in midair with a sword. Why hasn't nobody done that in a game before?